Jesus asked, Have I been with you for so long a time, and still you do not know me, Philip? My dear friend, we have the Gospel of John chapter 14 verses 6 to 14 for our reflection today. Jesus asked, Have I been with you for so long a time and still you do not know me, Philip? The Holy Catholic Church celebrates the feast of saints James and Philip today. We see in these apostles James and Philip holy men who became the foundation stones of the church and we are reminded that holiness and its consequent apostolate are God's gift to us and not human achieving. We have the exasperation in the voice of Jesus where Jesus asked Philip, have I been with you so long a time and still you do not know me Philip. Probably Jesus has this exasperation in his voice right now when he speaks to our hearts too. We are like Philip, still looking for God's existence, proof for the existence of God. Philip and the other disciples could not digest the teachings of Jesus because their attention was focused on worldly things like power, pleasure, honor, and wealth. When our mind is diverted from divine things, we can't understand his teachings. That's where Jesus enables Philip today to understand that the Father and Jesus are one. A beautiful revelation of the Heavenly Father by Jesus. And the Trinity dwells in us too. That's why Jesus says, he who believes in me will do the work that I do and even greater things. We are able to do the things that Jesus does or even greater things because the Holy Trinity dwells in us and it is the Trinity that enables us to work miracles today. We are challenged today, today to recognize the dwelling presence of the Holy Trinity in us and become channels of God like Philip and James. They surrendered themselves totally and fully and God began working wonders. Even the work that Jesus did were performed by these two great men. Lord, give us the grace to understand that you are dwelling in us and deepen our faith. May the words of Jesus redeem us. Amen.